Let's do this. <laughs> Bonjour mes amis, my name is Fu and welcome back to my channel. In today's 12 days of food task video, I'm showing you guys what's in my bag. Um, disclaimer, I haven't uh, gotten anything out, that I haven't cleaned it or anything. This is everything that is in my bag every day. But I should mention that I am quite a neat person and I like to have, take all the receipts out as soon as I get home. I know unpack my bag, check everything that's in it, if there's anything that shouldn't be in it, like receipts or like, you know, food or anything that should not be in my bag, I take it out immediately because otherwise I maybe forget and I do not like to do that. I do not like to do that. I don't like to, you know, have things in it that shouldn't be in it. So don't expect too many crazy things because they will probably not be in it. So the first thing that's not really in my bag, but it's on my bag, it's a hair clip. Because you can never have enough hair clips and maybe I will forget to bring my hair clip along with me, which would be quite annoying. So the first thing I have is a hair clip. The second thing that um, I always have on me is a bottle of water. Uh, I'm against plastic. I try to minimize the use of plastic because we all have to be a little, more, little bit more uh, cautious of our environment and of our surroundings. So I have a glass bottle. The next thing that will obviously be in my bag is my wallet, which is this one. It's an adorable little wallet. It has all my money and all my cards in it. and. Uh, I think it's like the one number one essential to be in your bag, obviously. It's the wallet. The next thing that I have in my bag is my tablet or my iPad. I don't have it on me all the time, but when I'm at home, it's always there. So in case I would need it, uh, I won't forget it. Half of the time I do leave it at home because I don't need a tablet when I go shopping and I don't need a tablet when I'm you know, just going out with friends or anything. But um, maybe when I'm going to a meeting or when I'm going to class and I'm not taking my laptop and not taking my big book bag, then I'll probably be taking my iPad, which is uh, you know, quite handy to have in your bag. So that is the big next thing to have in my bag. The other thing that I have in my bag is this, which is a lime concentrate. <laughs> it's lime juice concentrated in a little ball and there's not that much in it. I tend to use fresh limes whenever I can, but now when it's winter and lime are, limes are scarce, uh, I still do, uh, like to enjoy my water with a little bit of lime juice. <laughs> so I have this one in my bag. It's almost empty and I use it for that exact purpose because I don't want to be carrying around a full bottle of this thing. Um, so yeah. Lime juice. The next things that I can find in my bag are wet wipes because you don't know when they come in handy and a little mirror because again you don't know when that comes in handy. The next thing that I have in my bag is a little makeup bag which has things like eyeliner and mascara. Ooh, that was the beauty blender which are things like hand cream and a little bit of uh, vas Vaseline, a hair tie a few bobby pins things like that essentials that will might you know come in handy again i don't take it out with me all the time but it comes in handy to have everything in a little pouch ready so in case i you know am in a hurry which i am most of the time i am in a hurry i can take it along with me just like that i don't have to take you know extra time to grab all these things and put them together because if i do have time i will probably not take these but this is like a little emergency kit you can you can call it that i think and a little little cute pink emergency kit the next thing that i have in my bag is this um maybelline makeup bag which says I'm worth it on it. You guys could probably not see it because of the reflection, but it has all sorts of things in it. So this has hand sanitizer. It has a little bit of face cream. It has a chapstick. It has markers. It has my iPad, iPad, my iPod Nano, uh, which has uh, these fun sticker thingies. If you're a law student or if you're a student anyways, you will recognize these. They, it has a couple of markers in them. It has a spoon. It has a spork, well not really a spork, it has a knife spork, well, it's a, it's a knife with a fork and a spoon. You guys get my drift. And a couple of pens in it, 
yeah again things that are quite that come in quite handy and i don't like to be uh i don't like to have a messy bag so instead of having them all over the place i put them in this little makeup bag which i wasn't using anyway i think that's everything you guys Oh yeah, and the last thing that I have on me are things like aspirin and stuff. So, so medis medication. And that is everything that's in my bag. It's not that much, and it's not quite interesting. But I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, nevertheless. This is one of my favorite bags. It's a um, leather leather it's a leather brown bag i really like the color and as you can see there are a few you know um use marks on it you can see that i've been using it quite intensely but yeah it's one of my favorite bags it's beautiful it goes with almost all my coats it's handy it's you know it's quite lightweight to carry around with you and I'm a girl, I love bags, I have a lot of bags, but I do need a go-to bag that is not that big, that's not that small, that fits everything right into one. That's this beauty for you. So that was it for today's video, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up. That lets me know that you enjoyed this content and would like to see similar content to this. Let me know in, in the comments or reach out to me on social media. Is there anything in my bag that surprised you? Are there things that should be in my bags? Am I missing bag essentials? Let me know. I've, I would really love to know that. Um, if you're not subscribed already, make sure to subscribe to my channel and put on the bell notifications. These are There's a bell somewhere around here in the bottom uh, next to the subscribe button. That way you will be notified when I upload a video because YouTube has changed everything around. It's just so annoying, but you know, just put on the bell notifications. That will be really amazing. Follow me on all the socials. These are in the description box down below. And that was it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I love you guys so much. And I will see you tomorrow with another 12 Days of Food Talks video. Dag wereld.